shit's in a different league Symphonies come with infantries And when we all crash, the bang is all that interests me They say I've crossed a red line Then they get crossed with red lines They try to off my top cause they can't get across these red lines What's going on, dope shit gang? It's your boy, Donna Bradley, back at y'all another video And today, we got Bo Burnham I know, it's been a minute, right? I think we, we reacted to like one Bo Burnham song on this channel But now we here, we got Art is Dead you know what I'm saying? Once again, just expanding the channel, checking out new shit. We got a few different things we're gonna check out today. I was just trying to see what's up, what else is going on out there, and also some things like what did you Dave has uh, pitched to me. So we're gonna see what's up. Be sure to like, be sure to subscribe, follow me on all that there, social media. And if there's anything y'all want me to react to, look in the description. Please help support the channel. We'll get your name in the video, shout you out in that form. But as for now, we ain't hear that any further ado. Three, two, one, click! This song isn't funny at all, but it helps me sleep at night. What? I want funny. Oh, I think we might still be getting that. Yo, this man kill at some piano. Yo, if y'all want to see some crazy ass piano work, Rachel Hurst, R A C H E L H U R S T. She's my sister. Murders on the piano. All right, let's go. Art is dead. Art is dead. Art is dead. Is dead. Entertainers like to seem complicated, but we're not complicated. I can explain it pretty easily. Have you ever been to a birthday party for children and one of the children won't stop screaming because he's just a little attention attractor. When he grows up to be a comic or actor, he'll be Yo. rewarded for never maturing, for never- Yo, whoa, whoa. <laughs> So he said, I'm just gonna, he said, it's not facts. I'm gonna just, I'm sorry, he said, it's not comedy. I'm gonna just go in here and I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna sing facts at you. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> okay. I'm vibing. I'm vibing. Yo, the, the tune, the tune got a little bouncy, bouncy, do, 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 but yo, about the whole motherfucker's not, doesn't mature, so he grows up to be an actor and he rewarded for not maturing so he just, he just wants to be some facts at you okay stop screaming because he's just a little attention attractor when he grows up to be a comic or actor he'll be rewarded for never maturing for never understanding or learning that every day can't be about him there's other people you selfish asshole i must be psychotic i must be demented to think that i'm worthy of all this attention yo yeah, this is funny, but like, it... there's some truth in there. I think that's, that's, that's like, that's like the best comedy. When that hinges on that little bit of truth, you know what I'm saying? Because I'm very sure there's enough muppets like this to make this an entire ballad statement. You feel me? Let's go. Let's go. Of all be about him there's other people there's you other people you I, must be psychotic. I must be demented to think that i'm worthy of all this attention of all of this money you worked really hard for i slept in late while you worked at the drugstore i mean i mean i think like what <laughs> it depends on how you get it <laughs> you know what i'm saying it depends on how you get it like if you worked hard and you, you like got your claim to fame through like hard work, perseverance, doing what you had to do to get to where you're going. You don't got nothing to be sorry about. But like, if you just one of the people that has your handed to you, because it, it do exist. I mean, I don't know if you got to feel bad about it, but like, you can't. You got to acknowledge the other hard work that people put in. Like, period. You feel me? It's like one of those things. It's one of those things. There's too much, too, too many facts in this. There's too many facts in this. I must be demented to think that I'm worthy of all this attention, of all of this money you worked really hard for. I slept in late while you worked at the drugstore. My drugs attention. I am an addict, but I get paid to indulge in my habit. It's oh my God, yo, that's a. Bar. Hold up, listen to that again. Tension really hard for. I slept in late while you worked at the drugstore. My drug attention. I am an addict, but I get paid to indulge in my habit. But I get I my drug is addiction. You say it's habit, whatever, but I get well no, I'm an addict, but I get paid to indulge in my hab in my habit. Yeah. What? That that was poetry. That shit was philosophical. That ain't 
just the whole vibe of the song don't fit how true that damn statement was like you know this song got wonky energy but that's just that right here you know what i'm saying yeah because you get these people that that they, they they thrive on that their heads get huge you know what i'm saying it's like they're living in a whole different goddamn ecosystem completely numb and unaware to the world around them but i mean they get paid to be that way it's like a perpetuating cycle that's just that's just factual statements bro attention i am an addict but i get paid to indulge in my habit it's all an illusion i'm wearing makeup i'm wearing makeup 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 it's art is a dead so people think you're funny how do we get those people's money i said i Yo, these people think you're funny. How do we get those people? Yo, the sorry, he's even singing the thing with wonky energy. You know what I'm saying? He's doing his thing though, like he hitting his little, his little notes. But yo, we gotta zero in on this subject matter, the lyrical content, bro. He like just like speaking on it, and like you gotta admit, like man, gotta be halfway referring to himself, like. <laughs> <laughs> like, come on, come on. The dead. So people think ah. funny. How do we get those people's money? I said, our heart is a dead. We're rolling in dough while Carlin rolls in his grave. His grave. His grave. I said, the show has got a budget. The show has got a budget. And all the poor people, way more deserving of the money, won't budget. Because I want it. Mm. That's a bar. He's got a budget. The poor people deserving and the money won't budget. That's a bar. That's a that's a homophone play. Let's go. People way more deserving of the money won't budget. Cause I wanted my name and lights. When I could have fed a family of four for 40 fucking. If you're this far in the video and you're not subscribed, what the fuck? Fortnite's. Yo, hold on. I'm a, I'm a, I used to be a stagehand, right? And I don't know why this was one of my things that I'd always notice and call out and just have my homies like rolling over because it was just funny to me. When these trucks would pull up, these big ass diesel trucks, and I tell you, man, we already, we built the stage, right? We built the stage. But these motherfuckers come in with like three damn diesel trucks full of more fucking stage. And you're just like, because <laughs> you gotta settle that shit up but you're like uh, you don't you know what i mean but and then they got they, 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 they face on the side of the thing like, like you, you made your money you doing your thing you want your face on the side of your truck you ain't face on the side of your that's a problem no problem but at the same time i'm just looking at it like you a pretentious asshole <laughs> i just feel like you gotta have your face on the whole track like hey if you know what i'm saying ain't nothing wrong with it ain't nothing wrong with it but you still sit there like you can hug me <laughs> like, let's go could have fed a family of four for 40 fucking fortnights, 40 fucking fortnights. I am an artist, please God forgive me. I am an artist, please don't revere me. I am an artist, please don't respect me. I am an artist, feel free to correct me. A self-centered hey. artist, self-obsessed artist. I am an artist, I am an artist, but I'm just a kid. I'm just a kid, I'm just a kid, kid, and maybe I'll grow out of it. Yo, <laughs> the kid, kid, kid. Yo, that was dope. What is the dope shit here? And maybe I'll grow out of it. Yo, yo, yeah. That that had that had funny stuff in it, but that was really true to what he said. It's not like funny. This is just a factual statement. You know what I'm saying? Just like the pretentiousness of some individuals who got blessed and didn't realize it and think that it was like deserved or owed to them and therefore everything that happens because of that is deserved or owed to them and they are completely out of touch with reality and it's 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 a factual statement i'm sorry like that that song just had a multitude multiple layers multiple layers of truth and I think, like, that's what got me the most from listening to all this. The wonky, comedic energy that the song was given was in direct contrast to the actual lyrical content. You know what I'm saying? There was nothing funny about that. 
<laughs> he's just I'm just spitting facts at you. You know what I'm saying? You take the song for what you want. If you want to laugh, go ahead and laugh. If you don't want to get the meaning and just laugh, that's that's all you. But if you just want to kind of dive into what the man is saying just a little bit, you 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 going to see you going to see that truth. You going to see that shit. That was that was that was a very interesting way to put that in a way that people could enjoy listening to while telling them some hard facts about the reality of motherfuckers on that level sometimes and he did a damn good job of it so we do that that's the take that's good shit that's that's what that's what we, that's what we like here that's 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 my that's, that's my take on it be sure to like be sure to subscribe follow me on all that there social media and i'll catch you on the next one family peace